In this lecture, we will know about the next type of the concurrency process. That one is uh, optim optimistic. We already know about the locking. That is a two-phase locking protocol. Then timestamp based protocol. Now the third one is the optimistic uh, process for to control the concurrency concurrent schedule. Then optimistic technique. It is based on assumption that conflict is rare. And this one is a point under the consideration of optimistic. We considering that the given uh, schedule it's come with uh, some rare conflict, and it is more efficient to allow transaction to proceed without delay to ensure the serializability. There are three phases. It is a read only or an update transaction. It contains a three phases. That one is a read phase, validation phase, and the write phase. To verify that one is a particular uh, given concurrent schedule is a serializable or not. But maybe here to maintain the consistency with the database, this technique which one is helps to. Uh, help to a particular uh, maintain the database consistent read phase read all necessary value on a local variable and carry out update on them not on the database itself means a read phase that one is only the when we update uh, any value like a that is uh, one database value then we just to uh, update the a value but not it update under the not it update under the database right now that is a read all necessary values on local variables and carry out the update on them not on the database itself second phase that one is a validation phase serializability and interference will be checked here we uh, uh, we check the serializability and the interference about the uh, particular uh, sequence we will verify it now the third write phase this follows the successful validation phase for updation updation transaction during this phase the update made to the local copy applied to the database means we read it update some value of particular variable but not update under the database then we validate that sequence then we write that if it is a valid then it, then we write that in a database now we need to verify the validation phase again what exact the process under the validation now to pass the validation test one of the following must be a true these are the two function the two conditions we need to say that that one is a, one of the condition is true then we can say that that is a validate now older transaction finished before a new start in this case set of data written by the earlier transaction are not once read by the current transaction that one is simply we just to go with the, this scenario like a uh, read validate and write right this one is a process of the first transaction now the second transaction is started with the after end of the first one with update the end of the first one it's again the read validate and write this is the one situation for validation right if second condition if this one is true then it's okay the particular process is uh, serializable or it may be it's okay no consistency occur under the database and then write the data now if it is this one is fails means what if any overlapping occurs now earlier transaction completes its write phase before the current transaction enter into the validation phase if it is okay with the overlapping like uh, the scenario mentioned here the overlapping is okay with like a read validate and write okay the overlapping is acceptable up to the read then the validate and write of a second transaction up to the this one is uh, acceptable like for that 
the first transaction we can say that that is a s second one is a t right now the start of a s uh, sorry start of a t start of a t that one is uh, less than finish of a s finish of a first transaction right means uh, before end of the first transaction second transaction started that's why the time is less and the validation of a second transaction is again less than this two if the condition true then we can say that this is a valid or the validation is done okay now the we can update the right phase under the database these are the two conditions out of one is a validated or this one is validated there is no need to check this one if this one is not validated then we need to validate with the second one that is simply the process of optimistic technique which one is verifies the particular concurrency process and this one is a third type of a technique to control the concurrency process thank you